performing at home has definitely been amazing. Um, there's been an intimacy that comes from performing at home. We get to welcome everyone into our personal space, which is a beautiful thing. Um, and at the same time, it's been a learning experience because we've had to become our own production crew, our own camera crew, setting up all of the the, the, the black seamless and, and just whatever it is that we're needing for our particular song for that moment. We're having to change from week to week our setup within our home. And uh, it's interesting. It's almost like two worlds are happening in our home at the same time. We're with our families in our natural home environment, but there's also a corner or a piece of our home that belongs to the voice. It's kind of the, the voice world at this point, a voice takeover is what I call it. So uh, it has been interesting. It's been a learning experience, something that I will always keep, I'll always have. I'll know how to, to do a, a video shoot or a photo shoot at this point for myself going forward. So I think that that's invaluable information. There are parts of the experience that we miss um, not being able to, to do, but at the same time, we still got those experiences as well. I miss being on the voice stage. I miss being in front of the voice uh, audience. I missed being there hands on with the crew as well as the other contestants because we were building and continue to build friends friendships. But at the same time, I, I certainly can't take away from the fact that we have um, made history and that we'll go down in history as, as a, a season that continued in the midst of a pandemic. So I, I'm grateful that we'll always have that. So I don't think that I would necessarily want to do a do-over. Um, I, I hope that this season will be, well, I believe that it will be amazing and that it will definitely be something that will catapult us all into something greater. <laughs> I definitely intend to do something to stay connected because I know that, you know, everything is not going to open up right away when this show is over. So it's a, it's going to be a challenge for us to make sure that we stay connected with our fans, stay connected with our supporters. And so yeah, it's definitely my intention. At this point, I have so much at my fingertips. It's my intention to continue to talk to the fans, continue to sing, continue to give them music, even if it is from the comfort of my own home so they continue to to be along uh, on my journey with me and, and hear my voice and, and know that I am um, um, caring about them just as much as they are about us going through this situation this pandemic Monday we got some surprises up our sleeves so you gotta everybody's gotta tune in I, I'm excited about Monday yes it's the last week we're, we're at the finale but we get to offer more than one song this week so I'm really excited about that and you'll get to hear different sides of our hearts and we've got you know, a, a cover, we've got an original, we've got a coach duet. I'm just really, really excited that we get to um, to sing some more music, sing more material and um, offer a different a different side of us. Yeah. And I think it's going to be fun. I really, really do. We've been working hard. A lot of hours have gone into this, but it's going to be well, well worth it. Um, I think that for me, the beautiful thing about music is that um, anything that you're dealing with or, or, or facing in life, there's a lyric that you can find that speaks to it, that you can identify with, that relates to whatever it is that you're, that you're facing. And that's the beautiful thing about music, that it, it, it speaks to us on so many levels, um, whether it's in pain, whether it's joy, whether it's a, a, a victory, whether it's a defeat, whatever it is. And I, I love that about music because I sing from all of those places. And I think that a, a, um, an album or an EP for me would definitely be full of that, but it would bring it full circle because I want to show light, love, and hope to everyone uh, in my music. So I want it to be inspirational. I want it to be power, empowering. I want people to remember that in the midst of struggle, we can still rise, um, that um, every day doesn't have to be a struggle, that you can find the joy in the little things. So I, I think that it would be kind of a mix of all of that, just something that reminds us to keep loving ourselves, um, to keep loving our hearts every day regardless, and to keep rising to the top. So please on Facebook and on Twitter, it is Tanisha Harris, T O N. E-I-S-H-A, Tanisha Harris. And then on Instagram, I am Tanisha Harris. I-A-M, Tanisha Harris.